story for you. Just for you. It goes like this. So, I'm at Disney World with my dog. You know, because, well, I'm always in Disney World because the whole Muppet show in the MGM Studios thing over there. Oh, what? That's a Muppet show and Moe's Sesame Street character, but the kids want Elmo, so Elmo has to be in Disney World. But I refuse to go to the MGM Studios because of the big tower full of terror. Oh, it's scary, okay? He's in the title. Oh, anyway. I'm with my dog in Disney World, I mean Animal Kingdom, and I decide I want to see the monkeys, you know, so I go over to the gorilla exhibit and I'm looking through the window and there are no monkeys, no gorillas, no nothing. So I go up to the guy and I'm like, let me in, I want to go see the monkeys with my dog. He's like, no, 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 we can't let you in. I'm like, mm, you tell Elmo that Elmo cannot go see the monkeys. He let us in. Anyways, so the whole time I've got this dog here, and it's a black dog, you know, same color for as the monkeys, the gorillas, whatever. And a big, big manly gorilla, he comes up and he like my dog. You know, he's like, oh, he's a nice dog. Uh, Elmo gets confused. Elmo, Elmo is like, okay, I see the gorilla. Alright, but the gorilla, he liked the dog, he let, he take the dog and he pick him up and go, he got the dog and he takes off with the dog, you know, and Elmo, Elmo has the dog on a leash, the, the extendable kind of goes, kind of leash, and Elmo's not paying attention, you know, the, the monkey's going that way, gorilla, he's going that way. And the leash is going, kind of thing, and you know, Elmo's looking over at the people looking at me, and I'm going, so, anyway, and then, the leash runs out, it don't extend anymore, so Elmo's busy going, so, and, pshum, gone, and Elmo's going with him, and we're going, and we're going, I'm just flying through the air, you know, El Elmo's not tall, Elmo's not very strong, you know, so when the gorilla takes the dog and it goes running really fast, Elmo gets picked up off the ground, go whoosh, zippity doo da day, all the way over there. Whew. And you know, the gorilla, he comes over to his, his monkey friends, which, you know, they're all girl monkeys, he's his special girl monkey friends. Oh, hold, hold on, Elmo has a text message. <laughs> Elmo, Elmo die from chain mail? I don't think so. Elmo doesn't need to send chain mail. Cause Elmo gonna live forever. You look at it. Anyway, so, the gorilla, he bring his dog to his monkey friends, you know. And I'm pretty sure that the big manly gorilla with my dog, he's the pimp monkey. And the other girl monkeys, you know, are special lady friends, if you, you know what Elmo means. So, he shows the dog to his lady friends, you know, woo -hoo. and the lady, the lady monkeys are like, so, he's a dog. I don't, I don't care about the dog. And so, the gorilla, he takes the dog and, <laughs> send the monk, they send the, the dog, whoosh, <laughs> Whoosh, whoosh, way over there. So, this is a long leash, okay? So, Elmo's still trying to catch up to these guys. Over there with the lady monkeys. And Elmo's going through. And all of a sudden, Elmo sees Elmo's dog go this way. You know, Elmo's going that way. So Elmo's like, oh, phew, you know, you know, kind of, you know, whoosh. Because I get just flipped around. And the dog was flying that way, and all of a sudden I'm looping around, coming to find when the dog. It gets worse. It gets. We go straight out of the exhibit, and the dog, 
I launched into a hot dog cart, you know, into the boiling oil of a hot dog cart. Elmo did not even know that Disney World has hot dog carts. Hot dog carts. See, Elmo has to say it with strange accent to say hot dog carts. <coughs> anyway, Elmo's getting slightly off topic. You know, with the air quotes and the wood. You know. Anyway, the dog, he go into the hot dog cart with the boiling oil and Elmo eventually catches up and goes whoosh back in there. You know, and the guy, you know, all those Disney World guys are so funny, haha, ha, smile. You know, he opens the thing, he looks and he picks up the dog and he's like, oh, he thinks he's going to be very funny. He thinks he's going to outsmart Elmo and he goes, oh, look, it's a real hot dog. <laughs> a hot dog. And he takes the dog and he puts him down. But then he looks at me, and apparently I look like a hot dog, so he just closes it. I'm still holding on to this leash. The dog is running. I don't know why I'm holding on to the leash, but I'm holding on to the leash. The dog keeps going, and all of a sudden, hot dog cart goes with him. Who, you know, it's got wheels, and it goes spinning, and it goes flying over that way. Oh man, Elmo, Elmo is not happy with this. Elmo, Elmo in boiling oil being pulled around in hot dog cart by Elmo's dog. You know, the guy says, ha ha ha, this is so funny, this is just Disney World. You know, because everything was planned out. But no, the dog is running. I don't know where the dog is running. I, I'm stuck inside the box of the hot dog cart, you know. Anyway, the dog keeps going and <coughs> hmm, thirsty. forward and I'm still holding on to this leash. I don't understand why but I just uh, too late to change my mind. The dog finds this big fountain in front of the whole park you know the giant fountain you know and he jumps right in you know he's got to get this oil and burning stuff that's burning me but not burning him anymore because he is a real dog. <laughs> yeah. uh. The dog jumps in the fountain, and the hot dog cart with the wheels is spinning, you know, it keeps going. It, it hits the stone, kind of thing, you know, and Elmo flies out. Now, the fountain isn't on. You know how usually it squirts the water out and whoosh, and Elmo goes straight up to the top and lands on top. The fountain's not on, so Elmo's just, you know, hanging out there. And then, the other nice employee of Disney World who thinks he's so funny, he turns on the fountain. And you know, Elmo's sitting there just right so that it builds water pressure. A lot of water pressure. Elmo's not a plumber, but Elmo knows you build enough pressure, you're eventually going to pop. You know, kind of, you, you know, you know, you know what Elmo's saying. So, all of a sudden, <laughs> kind of sound is coming out of the fountain, and all of a sudden, I go flying. Elmo goes, Whoosh. it's crazy. I'm still holding onto the leash. So that means that the dog is coming with me. And we go flying, you know, over that way, you know, whatever. This was painful. But, you know, here's the one silver lining. And I'm not thirsty, okay.
we go flying up off the park right into my limo. Now, you know how limos? Oh, you don't know because you're poor. Mm, do you have to watch YouTube to see real entertainment? That's the only way you're going to meet Elmo, you know. But anyways, in a limo, there is a nice portion of the roof that opens. It also close. Opens so you can get things in and out. You know, like stick out. Ooh, I'm in Las Vegas, you know, but it also closes. So you can have privacy. Well, when Elmo was going to Disney World, Elmo wanted privacy. So when Elmo got out of Elmo's limo, it was closed. So when Elmo comes back into the limo, into the limo, it was closed. Elmo crashes through the open and closing little thing and into the limo. And then the dog goes straight through. You know, he doesn't get hurt by the window. You know, you know Elmo already smashed it. Elmo lands in. And the dog. He lands on my lap. But. El, the dog is wet. Elmo does not. Elmo's already wet as it is. And then the dog, he just shakes around. And it makes Elmo very sad. But then Elmo got over it and became very angry and Elmo smashed the dog! <sighs> anyway, that's Elmo's story. Elmo go to Disney World, you know, blue, blue, go with us, hot dog cart, explosion, whoosh, sunroof, limo roof, smash, Elmo angry, Elmo smash! Elmo calm down, Elmo tell story. The end.